I've always been treated as nothing but a joke. But what if this so-called clown was the one that would cause you and everyone you care about eternal torment? Well, this is the story of how one misunderstanding led me to ruin my team's life. And it all started with a message. This is Soxel, and she has some information that was going to change my perspective on everything. Oh, and Jay, I forgot to tell you, but your team wants to replace you. Wait, what? At first, I didn't believe her, but at the same time, I didn't fully trust my team. It almost felt like they were hiding something from me. In fact, I had joined their team at the last minute, so it was possible that they let me join just to kill me. Pushing these thoughts aside, however, I went to my team's base while noticing something off about my team. As I was getting geared, they seemed to not even trust each other, and on top of that, one of our members, Blago, had left our team and gone to help our enemies, which so happened to have Soxel owning it. But even so, I was still willing to help my team win this war against Soxel's team. But the more I stayed, the more my team argued. So I finally decided to ask. I'm gonna be honest, are you two even on the same team if you don't even trust each other? You haven't even played on the server at all, bro. Should you even be on our team? Honestly, we should just kick you off our team, honestly. Like, you don't really do anything helpful anyway, right? At this point, I didn't know who to trust anymore. And I knew that as long as these two teams were alive, this server will continue to spiral into chaos. So I decided then that the only way for this server to be at peace was to eliminate both teams. And my first opportunity would soon show up where I would get an opportunity to kill Blago. I was heavily undergeared and would probably die, but I knew that I had to take this chance. I'll be honest, I didn't expect you to be here. You leaked your own cords and didn't expect someone to show up. You're here? He's here. You're here. Did you know, Jay, you're wearing the armor that I gave you? Or am I? So are we gonna fight or not? Or what? But why? Why Starless of all people? I guess it's a question that will go unanswered. You go unanswered? Really? Hi. You're, you'll be exactly like the person you don't trust. Wait, do I fight? Yeah, I'll, I'll, wait, I'll give you a chance to get out of the water. My space bar is broke. My space bar is broken. Great. Too late. All people, I would never expect you to do this. Well, not not do this, but like, I, I, I would never expect to find you. Either. Times change. Yes, they do. This village, this, this, this zombie is literally griefing. I did have golden carrots. Yeah, okay, so that was, that was, I, was, I, I thought that was sticks for a second. You don't have you, you don't have pots, don't you? You do. Yeah. So that's it. 
I knew this was gonna happen, but to see it happen so quickly left me speechless. I wasn't going to give up on my goal of removing these two teams, but how could I do that if I can't even kill one player? Lego's words stuck with me. Why Starless of all people? Perhaps I really am just a joke. I never went through my plans and whenever I did get an opportunity, I never took it. So I guess the only way to finally see them fall was to set the world on fire and watch it burn. It seemed I was about to get a second chance, when I went to meet up with Soxel to receive something that would change the course of this server as I knew it, and ultimately see my team fall. So, you're Paul J. Uh, I'm here to tell you that your spirit animal is an axolotl. What? You may be confused as to why I now have an axolotl. Well, allow me to welcome you to the Spirit SMP. On this server, you are given a random spirit animal that will give you different buffs and abilities. And it just so happened that this axolotl was the most broken one of all of them, making me practically invincible. Yeah, but the, yeah right now the ability is like hella overpowered, but that will be changed. Uh, so we use the ability? How do I do it? Just right click it? Yeah. Did you do it? Yeah, it's on cooldown now. Oh my gosh. Yeah. See, look, you're regenerating really fast. See, see, look how fast you're regenerating. I was ready to confront Blago again, but someone would show up. It was my teammate, or at least I thought he was, until I got a message from Soxel saying otherwise. Wait, whose team are you on? Not yours anymore. What? Okay, okay, that that's kind of rude. After realizing that Rose had left our team, I thought that it was a good time to finally test the true capabilities of this spirit. This bad bunny room, I need this gone. Oh wow. Oh, you're not on our team anymore, so... What? You said you weren't yourself. Wait, you guys are teamed? Eh, temporary lines. <laughs> that is jump you know, really is your downfall, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wait, I just realized. I can't you can't. Alright. Oh, uh, oh, you think you can drop Soxel? Oh my gosh, you actually did. <laughs> I'm going to spawn. I'm being jumped by um, this kid called Pal. Please, bro. Perfect. Bro, please, like, go to spawn, bro. You want to kill him, bro? Yeah, let's get on, bro. Are we a team, Soxel? Are we a team? Perfect. Well, Hi, Hi, your Pharaoh. Hi. Wait, you gotta kill me. Hey, no, this guy's running the portal. Okay, what are you using? What's up? Oh, please, just let me be. Why are you all dead so bad? Well, I don't really need to worry too much about chasing him. He challenged me to a duel later. I'll kill him then. What really matters is that my so-called team had ended up death banning themselves from the atrocities they had caused. So that gets rid of most of my targets, and Blago's team isn't really a problem anymore with them gone. And with all that, it just leaves Rose. Huh. Guess he really is my biggest worry. If I win, then my goal would have been completed. This server would finally be at peace. Guess I just need to see how things play out.
You know what stakes are on the line if you lose. I know. Never expected things to end up where they are now, but here we are. There's no turning back. You ready? Yeah. Well, everything's been leading up to this. The end of something that barely even began. Can't say I'm surprised either. Just that maybe there was a better way to end this. Oh well, too late to turn back now. Oh god. I'm shaking right now, bro. I don't know why. Wait, does rain give you regen? No, it doesn't. Okay. Dude, they should make it so that Strider gets weakness during rain. Nah. I don't care. I'm... So, this might be a bit harder than I thought. He has a new spirit making it much harder to fight against him. But I can't back out of this. I made a promise to finish this, and I intend on keeping that promise. Either way this fight goes, this is where it ends. My goal this whole time was to kill Star Wars' team, the cause of all this conflict, and you are part of the problem. So because of that, you need to die here. So if that means I need to die multiple times to finally see you fall, then so be it. Yep. And it's GG's. I'm dead here. That little rat scurried away out of my grasp again. You may have escaped, but no matter how long it takes, no matter how many times I have to die, no matter how long you run, I will find you. And I will make your life a living nightmare. I promise you that. And I guess I didn't have to wait too long. Because he's right here. And I'm not waiting any longer to finally get rid of him. Okay, that's it. You? Kill him. You, I'm, Kill I'm sick of you. No, no, no. Wait, is he good? Wait, he's gonna respawn! He respawned! Get him, okay, get that's him, it, that's it, him. that's it, that's it. We're done. We're farming him right now. We're farming him right now. Kill him. Kill him. Yeah! Oh, lives are protected. Wait, he's in here? He has one life. He has one life. There's one life? No, death ban this guy. Well, you had a good run, but your consequences have finally caught up to you. Goodbye, Rose. I'll see you soon. Oh my god! Well, that's it. Everything's over. This server is finally at peace. Not sure what happens now, though. I thought there'd be more to this, but I guess the feeling of success is just temporary. So what's really left for me anymore? Oh, it's you. Let's go over here. I think you remember that last time we discussed, you know, our plan. It's done. They're all dead. Wait, what? You did it? Star Wars' team is gone. Oh, what are you doing? I have one life left. I've I've done all I needed to do. Here, here, Jay, Jay. Instead of this, instead of that, instead of what, whatever you wanted to do, there's something, there's something that still needs to be done. Well, the server, as you know, it doesn't have much conflict. And right now, you're the only source of that. Now, to get more, how about you and I create something? Bad things are gonna happen. 
Because, well, to every light part of the world, there's always a shadow. So do we be that light or do we be that shadow? Where does that leave me, though? Well, if I'm being honest, I'm not really sure. I guess it leaves you at a crossroads. I know you hate the sapling cult and that's okay, right? I'm not talking about making a cult to do this, right? I'm talking about making a new uprising. And, well, we'll be the first two members. Sounds interesting. I'm in. Well, if you want to watch the world burn down, I'll watch the flames with you.